Uh, the game celebration, uh, Jordan Sparks and Two Chains double tap. 1437 on Gaga CFM. So this is Katsu But we're going straight to this. Oh, yes. So Tanileto is finally here with us once again. Hello, Tanileto. Hello. How are you doing? Ah, uh, see, fantastic. So, no, can, can you go? Yeah, I'm going to talk to you on the afternoon show. That's my yeah. Ah, what? Whoa, whoa there. Wait, never mind. Cool. Let's talk about September. It's tourism month as well as the heritage month. Yeah. And we're talking during, I think, in the first hour of the show when we were talking about its neck. Uh, talking about Ubuntu and everything, but when I'm at trends again, I'm a corner, let's cut it up. Uh, when it's cut up, but that's from shutter corner, but you want to say, by a beso, mobile in tank, by a beso again, we're just channel now, but we're not in tank again. Oh, because I'm a bio mess. Uh, wow, I'm not on that one, but let's talk outfit. Now, I'm a traditional outfit. Uh, Clarissa was wearing one, one of them when uh, on your on your on your big day. Let's let's look at the I'm a trans guy corner this time. Uh, yeah. we we've seen them. We my perfect wedding as well. Uh, but we're not about that. Emma from a trans also this uh, this season. Well, basically, I mean, as we said last time, once everyone is into the African trend, everyone's mm. loving that and embracing that now and designers have moved towards you know shifting the culture and moving into what people want meeting the demand that people are for yeah mm -hmm. yes so the different prints that different cultures have that's what we're in and about right now that's what we want so yeah can, can you ever go wrong with with like a traditional you know attire let's yeah. say for instance like a zulu attire because yeah. that's different we can say african you know and traditional whatever but you know you have to section it there's in the melee yeah. this is zulu and this is sort of all that stuff the thing is, you can hardly go wrong, and especially it's a white wedding now, or it's a traditional wedding, because at any of the occasions, everyone's about it. Um, and yeah, you can't go wrong, because there's different designs, as much as So you can't be that worried about it, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cool. cool. Uh, I just want to find out something here. Uh, yeah. What should you look for if uh, when you're choosing something here, uh, traditional uh, attire? Should you even start consulting your partner because you have to look at your skin color as well? Or look at your skin color as well? Or maybe you want J as a Muntress Lisa in the West Fazan as well? Yeah, I think if you're all about matchy matchy, you can do that. But I think the most important part is that Abantu aren't as educated about what the different colors mean and if they're offensive in some other cultures. So that's, that's a very, true. very important mm. thing to mm. find out. So who's okay? Mengi um shato um zulu, you know, what is the color that I should be wearing or should stay away from? What does it mean, you know? Mm -hmm. I see, I yeah. See. Uh, let's talk about uh, uh, designers that you can look forward to, yeah. you know, that we can probably kind of steal stars from when we see them post. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can steal it here and there. So, yeah. which designers are we looking for, you know, who are doing it right? And even with the brides, you know, who want yeah. to check it up, want to check a designer, with those simple, like, traditional inspirations going on? Well, Khojian Kutia, known for, you know, the elegance and the couture gowns, has also stepped into the African attire kind of range right now. Mm. Uh, we saw as well, it's on the uh, Fashion Um Swenko, the Big Bang page on mm. Facebook. You can see Sarah Lang is wedding there. Mm. Um, attire it's, it's by him, yeah. actually. And you've got as well accessories by Nto Zinke going on over there. And then you can also find Tuela Nguyeza. I'm mm -hmm. so obsessed with his collection right now. Um, also on the page, you'll see some pictures there. Um, Kona Upgel Mabalani there modeling okay. that. Yeah, there's also Busi, who's the artist, the singer, mm -hmm. and you see how he's uniquely um designed designed wedding gowns. Would say no, you can wear this down the aisle. You can wear this at umemu umembe soak or whatever mm -hmm. it is that you're doing. Mm -hmm. So versatile. Okay. Yeah. And uh, about basically, it's about channel twin plus cool. Yo. And uh, and then Masabeti, it's a Zulu attire. Yes. And and I always say it's it's wrong for for people to say that <laughs> because. Le in Placello, about Oba Oba, but Pesha, I'm a club, I'm a set up. So now, uh, 
So now, and my say we are simple as I see a trend mm. and try to Zulu attire. Oh, it's quite tricky, but I think that's a market actually. Now that you mention it, yeah. so that is yeah. a market, and no one's tapping into that yeah. market right now. Can we get designs for guys? Ah, uh, yes, yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. I feel like sometimes they feel safe with even like a dashiki, and it's like, whoa, what, what's up? Yeah, we like that. Tanola, thank you very much. Uh, good to be Natila, and people can follow you on Twitter, Facebook. Which yes. are you blog as well? I blog as well. Check out my website www.imsandoretu.com. Check me out on YouTube at Sandu Tsekiso and Facebook and Twitter at Sandu Tsekiso and Instagram at I am Sandu Thank you so much, honey. Thank you.